Vail Soccer Field in Raleigh, North Carolina here, and a lovely night for some men's soccer. And away we go. Sit back, relax, and enjoy this one. Here come the Wolfpack the other way. Pass through to towards Sir Camp. Works out wide, tries to set across into the box. Uzo heads it out. Corral once again, long strike from NC State. It was a laser beam. Still scoreless. Little pushing foul right there, and that's going to be called. Here's the free kick. Ends up curling in. Solid defensive play by the Chanticleers. Could have sprung a couple players forward. Wanamiller coming back the other way, and he had his shot blocked off. Surkamp sends it up in the air. Wanamiller brings it down. Here's an opportunity. Wanamiller across! And it never made it to the net. A solid block shot right there. It's appearing to me that Coastal's going to be able to make something out of nothing on some of these plays. Another, Coastal's offense is very determined. Another quick play off the corner. Opportunity. A header! Goes in! Coastal! Has the first goal of the match. It'll be controlled, brought down. Shanta clears, looking for a long strike, and he scored! Surprise shot straight in the back of the net, and Coastal Carolina has scored again, and they're up a deuce. Here goes Follinsby. He's got a good run on it. Follinsby with the cross. Camargo shoots up. He scores! It's Camargo again! And he'll do a little salsa in the box. Again has it. Lays it forward. Good curl on the ball. Stepped up state. Trying to make a run at it. To the goal. And it rolled through the goal. Breeze, but no. Drops this one back for Dargen. Sir Camp gets a little help of the steal. Opportunity going the other way. It's holding Fender. Rolls it in front state. Taps it in. What a miller. Breaks the shutout. And at least a slight ray of sunshine is shining through the gloom here. It is 3 to 1. Jordan Tyler who pulls it down, pokes it ahead. Another opportunity. McCauley came sliding out. The ball is in, but it will not count offside. Cuts it around. It's going to go off of Wanamiller. Could spring a chance forward. Good beat by Sir Camp. Here's Wanamiller. Really chugging the legs after it. Looking for another shot, and he's going to be angled out at the last second. Solid defense. State. Controlling now, it's Nudson. Works on the outside. Quick stretch play, all the way forward. The rising defensive play there. Beat it back down, a diving stop by Cook Corrales. Nudson has it. Curling, holding, Nudson. Trips on the play, managed to find a way to get the ball to a teammate. State has a little bit of open room, a long pop at it. Cook Corrales got it. It's Nudson who rolls it forward. Sir Camp looked like he wanted to go in for a diving header. This one's going to be popped very high. Peterson jumping up, plays it aerially into some open space. A lot of body contact there. It'll be a free kick for Coastal. They're going to be scrapping. Peterson, he's going to be taken down. Foul when we have a card to follow. A little bit of aid from the trainer there. We'll see who NC State's going to send in as a sub game so far. Tight end wall. Here's a strike right into the midsection of Cook Corrales. That's a squandered opportunity for NC State. Perfect chance to put one in the back of the net. And instead it was struck right at the goaltender in yellow. Aerial contention and a foul call. Free kick for State. This is going to be moved quickly forward. That was allowing his offense to get set up downfield. They're going to roll it ahead. Stretch play off of a couple of heads. Another play right in front. Curling for a shot right there. Sir Camp never got a good foot to it. Well, the effort's been there all night from number nine. The execution has not. This one, lollipop up in the air. Corral is NC State looking to regain possession. It's Pierrenson instead. Ellis Pierrenson had a couple of teammates calling for the ball. He ends up going down for McLaws here. He's going to be taken down, and that's going to be a foul against NC State's Reed Norton. And it looks like we may have another injury as McLaws is a little shaken up on the play. He's up. Looks like he just took a bit of a stinger. 
Reed Norton was not afraid to voice his frustration on that previous call either. Bjornsson sends that one wide of the box and another one has popped back into the softball complex high. So this will be McCauley with another kick out for Jackson Otogi. Lost Jackson Otogi sends this one high up in the air. As Gunmanson with the play on the ball. Bjornsson has it once again, leads Jordan Tyler forward but a little too much. The Chanticleers will next travel to Bowie's Creek, North Carolina to take on the Campbell University Camels. And then they will return home to face Presbyterian. Nine, NC eight, State seven, will host six, a newcomer five, to the ACC, four, Louisville, coming up. Then Gardner Webb before going back on the road up in Chestnut Hill to face Boston College. That concludes tonight's match.